You have entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live every week. Turn on notifications to never miss an episode. Now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. It's that everywhere. Happens. That happens with my if my kids can't get ready and the husband that kind of makes for a tough right. morning. So you that's know, that's the empathizing. Right. So whatever story they tell you, um, well, I always tell this to to our clients: just be a human, right? right. Um, empathize with the customer because again, they don't want to be calling you. So say, oh man, I'm really sorry that 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 happened, or gosh, that happened to me, or whatever. But empathize with them. Don't be fake. Right. Be real, but but um, be human, right? right. Um, and let them tell their story. They they want to tell their story. They want to be heard, and it's almost like a a release. Okay, I can you know get this off off my chest. This person sounds like they've done this before, and they're going to get me taken care of, and I can relax. Right. Mm-hmm. And again, having having a female do this. Normally, they're not the plumber. Okay. Right. Uh, females usually are more empathetic. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, and and again, going back to not being the plumber, we can't, guys, we can't help it. As soon as we hear <laughs> the water heater or whatever's going on, we're we're trying to fix it. Right? How many times have you gotten in trouble with your wife about her telling you, just listen to me, just don't, don't, listen, don't, don't try fix to fix it. it, just listen to me, okay? Anybody, that's, hold that's on a second. <laughs> Any ladies out there, is that a complaint with you, with your husband, that you just you just want to kind of get it off your chest or talk or whatever, what and then as soon as I or in a scenario that has nothing to do with us, as soon as the wife tells the husband what they're feeling and the husband goes, well, here's what you should have done or here's how you solve that one. Right, right. Anybody, <laughs> ladies, can I get a witness? Right. Anyway, I just saw Dwayne said um, that Tana is way more sympathetic um, when it comes to um, listening to customers. So, right. Um, okay, and okay. so that, that's mm-hmm. an important thing that builds that relationship. And again, guys, it has nothing to do with plumbing. You don't care. Don't put the pressure on your CSRs to, well, let's find out if the water heater's in the basement and this and that. And, you know, some of the programs have a whole list that you can run people through. And the problem with doing that, now you make it a data entry thing. Right. Okay, no matter how easy it makes it a data entry. And you don't need to know that stuff. Right. And that's for a different conversation because you want your guys to get out in, in, with, in front of the customer and listen to the customer, right. not go right to what you think the problem is. Mm-hmm. Okay. So... Don't, don't put that kind of pressure on your CSRs. Right. Allow them. It's more important to build that relationship there, okay? Mm-hmm. And that leads us to the, the final, most important thing, the whole reason, the whole reason for, for taking the call, <laughs> okay? Number three. Wait, we're not going to tell you yet. And jo- Sparky just it. called me, so I'm hoping that there's not an issue, and I see something weird on the screen. So um, hopefully, and I see we're still streaming, so um, okay. yeah, I don't know what it is.